Hello, it's Jackie from Castle Connections Travel. Um, I wanted to start doing these videos for tips, tricks, reviews, and really anything. Um, I've planned lots of trips for families, and probably the number one request I get is they want to do something special for their kids, um, whether it be a birthday or just really any reason at all. Um, first thing I'm going to tell you, if you are celebrating anything, go to your resort's front desk uh, or guest relations in any park and ask for the special buttons. Um, I'm told cast members will make your trip extra special if you have a special button on you. Um, I will do a review at a later date because uh, I'm going for my son's first birthday in Disney. I'm a little curious what kind of special treatments they actually give you. Um, but that's something free that you can do at any time. They have, you know, celebrating, anniversary, first trip, birthdays. Um, they probably have a few other ones, ones that are blank that you can write something in, you know, um, all sorts of buttons. Um, so how to make your trip more magical for your kids. The first one um, that everybody knows about is the Bibbidi Boppity Boutique. So they have the Bibbidi Boppity Boutique in Cinderella's Castle at Walt Disney World, and the second location is at Disney Springs. Um, the location at Disney Springs has lots of openings. You can probably go anytime, and it's not going to be super busy. If you're going to Cinderella's Castle, you're going to want to book 180 days out. Um, even calling at 7 in the morning, you may only have afternoon appointments because it will sell out. Um, so definitely call make reservations. They have many packages. Um, the cheapest package starts at $65, includes hair, makeup, princess sash, nail polish, um, and that's the crown package. Uh, you can bring a dress of your own from home to, you know, if you don't want to spend the money. Um, they do have a castle package that is the same thing, only includes a dress that they get to pick out, and it's a 90-minute appointment. Um, they have uh, they have packages that go up to like $450, $500. So sky's the limit per usual at Disney. Um, if you have a little prince with you, they have packages for princes. Um, they have a night package for $20 or the deluxe package includes the costume and that's $80. Um, something similar to that is the Pirates League, which uh, is an adventure land. Um, packages start at uh, $45. They, you can be a captain, Captain Hook, zombie, ghosted pirate, black-eyed Jack. Um, you know, they have swords, bandanas, tattoos, um, and all sorts of fun extras. They also have mermaid packages if you have a little girl who's into that. I know mine loves mermaids. Um, so those are really popular as well. Um, the third one is really for kids and adults, but it's the special um, parties that Magic Kingdom hosts. They have Mickey's Not-So-Scary Halloween Party, and they have Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. These parties, um, they'll probably be about around $100 a person. Uh, the Halloween party starts at $75, Christmas party starts at $95. Um, excuse me, and these parties start at 6 p.m., on select nights, they kick everybody else out of the park. Um, so the park is um, pretty empty. It's probably at about half capacity. So all the rides have very, very low weights, probably 20, 30 minutes on the, you know, Seven Dwarves Mine Train or any of the mountains, very low weights. Um, in addition to that, the Halloween party has trick-or-treating, and they're going to give you a huge bag. And they will give you candy by the handfuls um, and you will have a full bag when you leave. Um, so on top of that they also do special um, fireworks, hallow wishes, they do special parades, uh, special shows, uh, special character meet and greets that you don't see during any other time, um, and the park is open till midnight. So it is, it's definitely worth a hundred bucks. I've been to the Halloween one, it is, it's awesome. Uh, this year I'm going to the Christmas party, so I'm going to try to do my best to get as much coverage as possible. Um, but it's the same thing. They have special fireworks, special um, parades, meet and greets. Um, and the Christmas one does <clears throat> uh, hot chocolate and all sorts of sweet treats around the park. So I'm really excited to do that this year. Um, well worth the money. I can't say it enough. They're so worth it just to go in there and not have the weights and it's half crowded. It feels almost like you're at the park by yourself. It's 
it's crazy. It's, it's, it's awesome. I definitely recommend it to anybody. Um, I just had clients of mine book a second night because they're so excited about it. So definitely check it out. <clears throat> um, the last little special uh, thing I'm going to talk about is a fireworks cruise um, at the select resorts, the deluxe resorts that have a marina at them. I believe it's uh, the Contemporary, the Wilderness Lodge, the Polynesian, and the Grand Floridian all have um, marinas at them. And you can, um, you can rent out a pontoon boat that seats there's the smallest one is a 21 foot pontoon and that seats eight people and it's $299 an hour. Um, you can rent it for an hour, set sail, watch the fireworks and go back to your resort. Um, if you're going to get really crazy, you can go rent the grand yacht from the grand Floridian. Uh, and this is probably about a 50, 52 foot yacht and it's $399 an hour, but that seats 18 people. Um, if you're really extra, it seats 17 people and you can bring a butler with you because they offer that service if you want to get real crazy. Uh, I can't afford that, but hey, maybe someday, maybe someday. Um, that's about all I have for extras. Um, if you like this video, please give me a like and a follow. Let me know in the comments if there's something that you want to hear about. Um, I'm definitely going to try doing this for like an adult version at some point. Um, have a good night. Hope this was helpful and contact me if you have any questions.